So we're up by the dam. It's kind of windy today and I had to fight the wind to drift. It's a walleye. No, it's his keeper. Nice auger to start off the day. Probably 15 and a half, hopefully. Yes, yeah, she's 15 and a half. Live well. On the ringworm. Another soccer. This one's not a keeper. Ringworm from B Fish and Tackle in the wind. Go cool. bye bye. So here is a walleye that swallowed the top water's tank's crankbait. You can look at how deep that sucker took his crank, his swim bait. Doc's their swimmer too. Works good. Did we just really catch a dink on this? Oh my gosh. This is fucking... That is hilarious. That is one hungry walleye. We must be on top of the Dinker School on this pot of bay. School on this pot of bay. We should probably move. Here's the first fish on this nice little lake sturgeon we caught on a minnow on bottom. I knew when we dinkered, we catch some of these. We gotta let it go. Is this our keeper? Which is just short. Nice sauger on the docks there, swimmer. Yeah. Nice 
nice soccer though, we're gonna get it back. Nice fat female Sager. Sager slaying in the cold. 15 and 3 quarters. Keeper number two. One more to go. In the snow. What other plastics do I have? Where are those things? It sucks that I have so many baits that when I want to find the plastics I want. There's some chartreuse flutes. I bet you those will work. Should we try digging a chartreuse flute? Those are the right color. We better try this. We're gonna try our Lake Hopping Custom Baits Fluke on a jig. They're hitting the plastic this color, so I bet you they'll hit this. We're still going a mile an hour. Holy fuck. Got one on Lubaka's bait. Is this another keeper? No. It's 14 and a half. Well, we got a sager on one of Lubaka's flukes on a jig head. Just fishing it down deep. We'll measure it, but it's not quite long enough. Yep, it is 14 and 3 quarter, 14 and 7 eighths, just a hair short. They're for some reason liking the chartreuse color though. Please be a keeper so then I can head in. Decent, whatever it is. Probably a 17 inch walleye. No, it's a sager. And it's probably 14 and 7 eighths. Not hooked very well. Another one on Lubaka's baits. So my Lake Hop and Custom Baits fluke. It's a female. Oh. You know what? He's 15 and a quarter, so we're heading in. We got our three keepers. Night, stay efficient. 
time to head in and warm up. Yes, we are. It's snowing out. It's really cold. This is going to be the worst part to ride back. At least the wind is to my back this time rather than my face. And there's still four real men, three other real men out here fishing with me. I kept three saugers today. I caught like five walleye and probably like six or eight saugers and a sturgeon. Good morning to fishing. I think found when I was trying to fish with live bait, I was just getting dinks. But then when I put on these plastics, I started catching bigger fish. This one's from Mubaka Video at Lake Hop and Custom Baits on a 3 8 ounce jig head. This is on an underspin and are some Excite plastics from the Mystery Tackle Box Walleye Box. And these are Doc's Lure Company swimmers from the Topwater Kings channel. And they all caught some nice saugers. They all got a keeper, so it was a good day on the water. We're leaving the river. I love fishing the river when it's cold because it's just you and the birds and hardly one out anywhere out there. And you can see it's kind of breezy too. And we're at the BFW Park. We're trying to get out of here before the weather gets bad. It's supposed to be like a blizzard that come, is coming in later today. So I think we got our limit about the right time and it's time to come home. Today I started off drifting. It was really all day windy and tough drifting. So then I tried anchoring where I marked a pot of bait. And when I marked the pot of bait, it must have been where Dink City was because I kept getting picked, jigging, and I only caught like four dinky walleyes there. Then I went back to drifting. And then I got two saugers that are just short and two keeper saugers drifting with large like bass sized plastics. So, and they were liking their chartreuse and blue color for some reason. But I was also getting them on a white plat, swim bait plastic too. But all in all, we did decent for the weather conditions and it was really tough to draft. So it was a good morning on the river.